Hey, welcome to Couch Arcade. Welcome to Couch Arcade. I'm Joe. And I'm Adam. And we are playing Super Mario Sunshine here. Yes. And Joe, you said this is a game you've actually never even touched before. I've so. never played it in my That's life. Interesting. Got I've, you nice. Uh, I've heard about it, and I've wa I've always wanted to play it, but every time I see it somewhere on sale, it's ridiculously oh. expensive. Yes, it is. Well, it's, that means triple A title, title, but it's a good game. It's hard to find people. I've heard, you know, Look some people that. really don't like it, but it seems a lot of people don't want to sell their copies. Well, and, and that's the thing. I. <laughs> Okay, so the problem with it is this. We're just going to skip this intro, actually. Cause, okay, so here we go. Basis for the story. They're going on a vacation, and the ship, or the plane, has crash-landed on an island. That's where you start. And Peach gets captured. Uh, go figure. Okay, so um, a lot of people expected this game to be basically... Oh, wait, how do I... Mario 64, it? too. Exactly. Um, <clears throat> just because there's nothing going on here. Um... Yeah, and they were really pissed when they found out that it wasn't. Um, but, I mean, honestly, this is a good game. Like, I enjoyed playing this. I never... This is my original file right here. I never got through, like... How many total are there? Um, I think there? 120, just like in 64. Okay. Um, but I don't think that... I don't know. I don't know if there's anything special. So here you go. Here's your opening cutscene. I don't think there's anything special that happens. Um, like, significant... I don't know. I, I don't know. We could play through the entire thing if we wanted to. But, yeah, that's what we're here for. So, I think he got kissed. That's why he's got love eyes or something. But yeah, if we skipped the cutscene though. Okay. Well, whatever. So okay, so here something has painted Mario's face all over. Did you know? Actually, this is the first and only game to feature full uh, English voiceovers, like voice acting in the cutscenes. Yeah. Well, the that, only I mean, one. that makes. The first yeah. and the only three. Well, yeah, because they even got lives. like the whatever, like Senior Toad or whatever. So there he is. That's just, like Shadow Mario or whatever. Shadow I forget Mario. what they call him, but it's Shadow Mario. I'm sure. <laughs> In my research, Peach has her clueless look right over her face. Like, what's going on? Do her eyes just like move slightly farther apart? She has always. Okay, so I've noticed this, and especially in recent games, Peach just has this completely vacant expression most of the time. Like, she doesn't... <laughs> she's just... What's going on? I don't know what's happening here. Was that Mario? But, okay, so... Mario, be careful. I have a bad feeling about this. So, okay, I gotta get reactivated. So... Right. Looks good. It is. I mean, in the, honest to God, the polish on this game was incredible. I, I remember getting my GameCube on Christmas morning when I was, like... I don't remember how old I was. Like, 13 years old. Uh, I don't know, 14, maybe? I don't uh, know, I was in high school. Seventh grade is when I got mine. Okay, so we were probably, yeah, I was probably like 13. 13. But, um, I remember getting it, and the, so you don't want to touch this, because it hurts you. Um, not right now, because, like, and you can do this. <laughs> That's how you get, like, paint off of you. It's all paint, by the way. Um, but, so I remember getting it, and this was the game that my parents got for me when I got it, and... Mm -hmm. I just remember looking at it, like, hooked it up, playing through it, and thinking, like, oh my gosh, this looks so incredible. Okay, so this is, yeah. Who, what? Okay, is this so thing? there's some different mechanics in this game. Um, I didn't talk to anybody, but they would have told you this is... Gad Science. That's the same, okay, so Professor Gad's the same yeah, who created yeah. the, the... Check this out, look at the bottom left-hand corner. They got, like, old footage from the old Mario games, like, they're 64 and stuff. Oh, nice. It's like, so he scans Mario to find out who he is. And, and then he can like, see into his yeah. past. Exactly. That's a little... Like, his history and stuff like that. That's a little that. weird. Um, he's got that have really shoes annoying, that look exactly like Mario's really shoes. annoying voice. With user instruction. Um, Maybe that's why they didn't do voice acting in any future Mario. Yeah. <laughs> Well, Mario doesn't talk. I mean, aside from his usual, like, let's go, you know, he doesn't sure, say but anything. That but... thing alone. You can then right. use a control so stick. So we go through. Press the X button to swing to the hover nozzle. I will eat but yeah, your so, family. So, yeah. <laughs> so this thing is called Flood. It's the Flash. F L U D D. Yeah, Flash Liquidizing Ultra Dousing Device. Liquidizer Ultra Dousing Device. The Flood. And created by Professor Gad. E Gad. Um. Same guy who created the Poltergust 3000 that Luigi uses in Luigi's Mansion. 
So it's cool. It's like some continuity there. And then actually in the first ever um, Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, no, I don't because I've played this game a billion times. Um, so you gotta, so, oh gosh. Oh, the controls are, they're backwards. Okay. Oh, that's a, what do you mean they're backwards? The, the camera, like normally when you turn like left and right, like left will turn the camera right, but it's turning it left and that's kind of obnoxious. But So well, that's preference. Can you change it? I can, but I don't, um, ugh. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna do it right now. Let's deal with it. Whatever. Deal with it. Yes. Um, okay. But, so, so, okay, so controls hold down to kind of, it like, you can still move when you hold it down. If you press down on it, you won't, you'll, like, be stationary, stationary shot, I and mean, then you gotta get this going here. And this is your sunshine version of the Prada plant. Pre, uh... Yeah. So his water is like, yeah. They don't like it. Um, anyways, what was I talking about? <laughs> I remember. Um, I don't know. I was thinking about Flood. F oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. F Flood. U D D. Flood, exactly. Okay, like, so Gad, um, the guy, he actually makes an appearance in Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. The original one, through Game Boy Advance. He's in that. He, he owns a coffee shop. It's kind of weird. And that's a weird but, thing for him to be doing. Yeah, just a bit. So, get my first shine sprite, is what they're called in this game. They are not, um... I prefer, uh, I prefer shine seven-ups. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what the heck you're talking about? Really? Shine seven-ups? Just think about it. Shine... Come on, man. Oh! Ah, okay. Come on. That's a bad joke. <laughs> yes, it okay, is. Okay, so Peach has not been caught yet. So, okay. Uh, she's, she's still just, like, through all of it. Hey, someone's coming! Uh. So, Flood, F L U D D. That's not a coincidence. Oh, yeah, okay, so they think he made the mess because of, like, Shadow Mario or whatever right. the heck his name is, and now he's getting tried in court, which is ridiculous. <laughs> With these, uh. Tree you like, do you like the textures that they use in the court? Just the black people. textures? They couldn't even render, like, a court scene? So hey, man, it's dramatic. <laughs> It's dramatic. I guess, sure. Uh, Especially with that, the music. Darn, darn. Doo -doo. It's dramatic. Look at that. You focus right on his stupid plant head. <laughs> oh, what are they called? I forget. Well, I mean, the, the aisle is called Isle Delfino, uh -huh. but I forget what they're... Like, they have a name, but they I don't do know what it is. The, so the shine sprites, yeah, they're the guardians of the island, and they've been doused and stolen and all that fun stuff. So, well, this is the first game these dudes are in. It's so I would imagine if we it's pay attention, we'll find out. <laughs> no, they're in uh, Paper Mario: The Thousand Year Door. Are they really? I think so. I have never played that one. Um, yeah, I think so. I think they are. I could be wrong, but because I never played this, but I'm somewhat familiar with this. <laughs> At the look of these fellows, these fine fellows. But that word flood, that's not a coincidence. Things like that are not a coincidence. Well, no. It's like the Patriot Act. That stands sure. for something. Sure. Which is not a coincidence. Yeah, okay, like, so just real quick, stop making it. This something why? I, what, in what world would they put someone in jail and give them, like, that thing? Just like, yeah, you can take that in your cell. Yeah, it's you all can right. take that creepy talking We don't know if it can blast a wall out. Mario, you witnessed this object after the air script, correct? <laughs> I really, I really well, hate that voice. Here's the thing. Even when it's asking a question, it's still a statement. Yeah. That's the thing. It's just very monotone. You, you saw this at the convenience store, <laughs> didn't you? <laughs> like, it's very accusatory. <laughs> Like, in the voice recording session, do you think this actor was, like, trying to put something into it? Uh, there's, oh, well, and they just, the, the director okay. just kept being like, no, 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 no. Refused to believe that Nothing. this was a voice. Like, this just was just flat. some, this was obviously, it had to have been done in a... Com no, yeah. listen to it. Mario, that's a person. A criminal. I can't, I don't know, you, you make that sound. There's too, it's too mechanical. Well, it's, I mean, yeah. you can do that. No, I don't want to hear that. Do you want to hear my explanation? Right, go straight again. that way. You can't miss the mess, pal. So now you have to go and clean up the mess. That's basically the premise for this game. You are accused of being, like, yeah, that's what starts the whole mess. Ha! <laughs> Get it? Okay, so yeah. Um, 
So that's that. So then so, you shoot you shoot water out of this creature's exactly. mouth. Well, yeah, exactly. So Delfino Plaza. All right. Well, that, oh, that looks delicious. All right, we're getting just about the end of the episode here. Um, all right, so next time we'll just keep on playing, and yeah. All right, see you guys next time. Boop. I love dessert, and I don't know if I opened a pack of ice cream Did or I get like one? a pint. Oh, I cleaned it up. All right, like a monster came out. I don't know that that would stop me from eating it. <laughs> I would probably just plus. I would say at that point you might need to reevaluate some like of your life choices. <laughs>